Rivaldo. That's a good ball to the sense of the word the sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days a fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very very long and it means so very very much the scene could not be more beautiful the pitch looks terrific the players are ready to get started from Mario they score and some of the best managers I've played for insisted on starting games as he needs to go on and we've just seen a very important open goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more he really does look at it so what's your view on that goal then well his most important job there was to keep the shot down and he did that without any problems that's good concentration you know Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. It's so often the case with goal scorers, little influence, and all of a sudden, bang. Fusai. Hoists it forward. What a throw in. Maradona. And it's played forward. Good ball. It's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? was easy, almost too easy. With Mario, is the obvious danger man here, and yet he was afforded way too much freedom. I think he was gifted that goal. His reputation should have been warning enough for them. Koulibaly. Mertens are more than happy to take the muscular approach. Now it's from Mario. Politano. Mertens. Now it's from Mario. And it's Rivaldo. Maradona set up one goal so far. Lozano. Nedved. And here's from Mario. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Roberto Carlos. Maldini coming up to half time leading it's Maradona oh that's 
a fine save! Maradona sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. They've played it short. And it's from Mario. Shot a goal! He's gone for it! In for the floor! They are rockets! And the lead is extended still further. He was so alert to the possibilities there. Great stuff. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. He's made it three. Quite a day at the office for him. That defence must be sick of the sight of him. He's been persistent and ruthless all game. He just hasn't stopped working. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Looks to thread it through. Has a hit! They've scored! Really outwitted one-on-one. -on -one. Once more, he gets the better of the keeper. Well, was there ever any doubt? It made it look like he's done it over and over and over again. And he has. So is this the start of a comeback? Rivaldo. And here's from Mario. Bakayoko. And there is the half-time whistle. Well, it's hard to say whether the two-goal advantage under these circumstances is decisive or not, but so far, I haven't really seen enough to indicate that the opposition could come out in the second half and improve to that degree. And that has been a goal blessed half. It's 3 1. Whistle goes, and we start the second half. No changes at half time that we're aware of. Broussai. Fabian Ruiz. Maradona. Did well to step in there. That was more than necessary. It's got through to him. Now it's from Mario. He could be in here. He's gone for it! about that I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too it was all very well drilled four in the game he is the man Napoli are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. So now the difference is three. Kusai. It's always a good time to register and, and lay down a, an early marker in the second half. They clearly had exactly that in mind and have gone about their business with Absolutely the right commitment. For a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Ball has crossed the line, and it's a throw. Romario gets on the end of it. Questions were asked, and he's given the answers. Maradona. 
Matsuda! Keeper gets just about enough of it. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot, and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. And it's been taken short. And here's from Mario. Defending, albeit from an unexpected source. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Romario decides to play it back. And here's Rivaldo. That's a good ball. Romario with a shot! It's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats. They knew, and yet they didn't need them. They paid the price and deserved to. How many more does he want? Bakayoko, Lorenzo Insignia, Politano, Mertens, over to the left, he gets past his man, it's Mertens! No, that's just why he trapped it expertly, Peter, and released it very differently. Lepied. And it's from Mario. Oh, well played, he saw that coming. From Mario. And here's Maratona. Rivaldo. Fabian Ruiz. Manolas. Bakayoko. Kulibali tries to get it forward quickly. Ford shows there will be three extra minutes. Kusai. He's got the ball glued to his feet. And that's been lever clear. Politano. Bakayoko. It's a loose ball. And that is that. The demolition, destruction, annihilation. They simply ran away with it. After all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, they had a game plan which was about hammering away in central positions, and it paid off. For me, they were persistent and ruthless. That's the end of our coverage for today. Many thanks to Jim Beckley alongside me. We'll see you next time.